Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Mori's Plays Let's Play of The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. And we are just continuing with our adventure. And I've just realized actually, I think we can go in even the deeper water now. The more dangerous water. I think we used a raft last time um, to cross the ocean. But it looks like now we don't even need that, which is pretty cool. But thank you so much for being here with me today. We're going to continue and head back to... Oh! I hope we can dive down. Whoa. I was not expecting that. I did that by pure accident to dodge the Zoras. What is this? This is so cool. But yes, we're just going to continue the adventure today. We're going to head back to Lilla City. Get some rings of praise. Buy a heart piece. Um, this is so cool. There's a whole underwater area here. This is pretty cool. Oh, what do we have here? A cave. Are you, what are you, a, a, like a Zora ghost? How I miss the smell and sound of the sea. Back in my day, I was the best Zora musician, a Zora musician. If I had an instrument, I could relive my youth. Oh, you're probably part of the trading sequence, right? What do we have? A magic ore. So that's definitely not an instrument. So, maybe we can try and continue that. If we get an instrument, we know this Zora ghost would want it. Um, but first, I think we need to head back to the village. I think we probably need to give the ore to the person who builds the rafts. Is that in the past or in the future? What's this? Uh, was it in the past? I think it was, it was either that house or the one in the future. Anyway, we can before we do anything, we need to head to the future to get the um, shop thing. I know what I mean. The harpies. We've got 500 rupees now. So I think, was it this one we could? I think it was here or is the tile up? One of them. This is probably going to put us in the fence, isn't it? Yep. In the fence. Oh, yes, we need to go up and across one. I think that's the same thing we did last time. There we go. But yeah, this is the secret shop that you can only access after you've gotten this um, instrument that allows you to go straight into the present again. It's the only way in here from that we found so far. And in here, apart from some geisha seeds and stuff, there is a heart piece, I believe. Yes, here we go. We'll be taking this, please. A piece of heart. 500 rupees. It hurts to do, but we need the piece of heart. And it fills the heart container, yes. Collect four in all to get an extra heart container. Check them on the item screen. Uh, you got four pieces of heart. That makes one heart container. We're only two heart containers away from maximum hearts. That's pretty cool. Right, does anything else come back in here? Ooh, a ring. We do have some rings to get a... We have at least one ring to get appraised anyway. I don't want to get ahead of myself. We have two rings, yeah. And a bunch of geisha seeds, actually, that we need to... Um, need to plant somewhere. Now, we do need to head to Abby's Palace. And I don't think we can get to it in the past. It's up here somewhere, isn't it? I don't think it even exists in the past, does it? Or maybe it does. Oh, Mori, don't startle me. You also heard the guard on the palace was down and came to save Nehru. If anyone is going to save her, it's me. I won't let you beat me to it. Uh, but it's no good entering from the front door. I know there should be a hidden entrance in the palace garden. Uh, I'll sneak in. Uh, I'll sneak in through. A secret entrance? What? Why do you know about the hidden passage on my first trip here? Never mind, I'm coming, Nehru. How did he find out about it? So we can't go through here. Okay, well, I thought the palace was only in the future. Oh, well, we'll come back here. We need to do this trade sequence first. And I think it's either... Let's plant a geisha seed here. I think it's... One of the raft places. Um... Oh, it's so hard to control the mermaid suit. I keep forgetting that we, we don't just have flippers anymore. It's either this one. Oh, wait a minute. 
or it's the one in the future or the present oh yeah it's not this one i think it's the other one right so in that case we need to go to the present again uh, oh i've still got it in my b button It's always fun doing this because you never know where you're going to land. Oh, Tingle! This isn't where I thought it would take us. Is there not a raft place here? I'm getting so confused. Oops. Maybe it was that. Um, place. Where was the place that we built the raft? Oh, wait, can we go on this now? <gasps> yeah, oh, wow, we can go underwater as well. That's so cool. Okay, we've got a lot of exploring to do then. Oh, is it the next one along? Hang on, let's go around here. Yes, this is it, isn't it? Oh, no, I'm getting so confused. Where's the raft house? South Shore. Shop. Maybe it is in the past then. How did we get to this island? I thought the raft was in the future. Okay, well we'll check the one in the past. But first, we need to go and get some rings of praise anyway. Wait, let me just check down here. No. That's so strange. I could have sworn there was something in the past. In the present. I'm getting so confused. But we need to be in the present anyway to appraise some rings. Oh my, you're amazing. You have, oh, slain a thousand monsters. Take this ring. Whoa, did we get that in seasons? You get a ring, get it appraised later. Okay, now we've got three rings to appraise. I think that's just a bragging rights ring though. I call this the red luck ring. Half damage from spiked floors. That's what that ring is. That's a pretty cool one. I see, I call this the toss ring. Throwing distance up, you have this one already. Oh no. 20 rupees. I see. I call this the Slayer's Ring. 1,000 beasts slain. That's what that ring is. I don't think it actually does anything. Yeah, I think that's just a bragging rights ring. Like a milestone. Right, while we're here, we just do a double check of the rings we've got. So we've got the no explosion ring, which is always useful. The armor ring is not that useful, to be honest. Uh, damage down, sword damage down. The protection ring is going to be so key to fighting bigger bosses towards the end. Although I think we are approaching the end of the game now, actually. We're closer than we probably realize. Um, power ring. Let's see what else we've got. Uh, toss ring could be useful. We'll, we'll go with the toss ring until we find anything else. Spike floors, probably not that useful. Uh, no damage from Zora's fire. That would have been useful a while ago. Although we are going to be diving. Let's take the... Ooh, do we want a Zora's fire? Yeah, let's take the Zora's fire one. Um, discover ring. Yeah, okay. I think we're good. We'll take the Zora's what, ring. And we'll always need to keep the protection ring on us. Right, I'm just getting a bit confused here. Let's just double check the palace entrance. I'm getting my past and present mixed up because I could have sworn the palace entrance was in the future. But it's not. It's in the past. Okay, so we need to go back to the past then, I think. I'm trying to find where we built that raft. It's not... I could have sworn it was in the present. Hopefully, we'll go back to where Tingle was. And hopefully our little teleport is still there. 
Do we need to speak to Tingle again? I don't remember. Right, we'll head back to the past. I, I think I'm getting a bit confused. This is not the one, is it? This is where we did the rope thing. Hmm. Right, let me check this. Oh, was it down? No, that was that village there. Oh, it was down here. Rafton's house. It was lower down than I thought, but it is in the past. This is where I suspect we need to take the ore, just because it's the only person who's mentioned, like, rafts or boats or anything. Here we go. There's a raft there as well. Not that we need it now, we have the mermaid suit. How did we not see it a minute ago? It's a, something I like about this game though is, even though places can be familiar, you can forget where places are. Oh, there's no one here. Oh, you are here. Hey, how goes the rafting? I'm thinking of entering a raft race, but I haven't been able to find a decent- Oh, there we go. We knew it. We knew it was somewhere. Uh, given the magic ore, yes. What are we going to get in return, though? Whoa, that ore, it looks like a toy, but I like it. Thanks. In exchange, I know. How's this? Lazily playing guitar while gazing at the moon is uh, so nice. You got the... Ooh! We got the sea ukulele. It has a sweet sea scent. Oh, we know who wants this, don't we? Oh, we're on the raft now. <laughs> Can we get off the raft? That, um, Zora ghost. Where was that? Was that here? Coast of no return. Yeah. Okay, let's head back that way. We must be getting close to finishing the trade sequence. We've been doing it a while. Um, and we've always somehow managed to keep on top of it. Actually, can we dive under this mermaid? No. Oh, I thought maybe that was a secret entrance. Right, let's head back out to... What's the best way to get where we just were? Around this cliff. So we almost did it in the right order. It's so cool that we can dive under here. It's like a third map. You can't do anything though. Can we destroy these? No. So you still can't get past the whirlpools, but... So I'm guessing this is the instrument that you want? You're an old musician? Um, how I miss the smell and sound of the sea. Give him the sea ukulele, yes! Uh, that ukulele has the spirit of the sea in it. That smell, that sound, that's good of you to respect your elders, kids. I see you're on some adventure. Well, I'll give you something old. This is... <gasps> what? No way! This is a hero's sword! That a great hero gave my ancestors long ago. Oh, it's broken. <laughs> you got the broken sword. Hey, it's broken. What's that? It's broken? Um... Uh, what, what a great sound. <laughs> oh, it's broken. Broken sword. It's broken, question mark. Um, okay, so we need to find somewhere that fixes it. Who can fix it? Um, I just want to explore the ocean. I wonder if the... Do you remember the person fixed the nut, didn't they? Was it a nut? Oh. Leave me alone! Oh, we're not going to risk having our rupees stolen. It's funny how all these areas just marry up with each other. And we're just all the way back here. Right, so yeah, there was a person who mended... I think it was a nut or something. For the... What was the town called? Um, Sym Symmetry Village. Yeah, that's right. Restoration Wall. That's got to be it, hasn't it? Restoration Wall. Uh, 
I wonder if there's anything else we need to do before going to the palace. Do we go to the resta restoration wall and see if they can fix our sword? We've been sidetracked a little bit. Do we get there from the past? Actually, we can just fast travel there. Oh, there's not one near it. What? How do we... What's the quickest way there, then? Actually, we're probably... Quicker to just walk. <laughs> So we've got to find a hidden entrance in the garden. But we can come back to that. So the palace, is this the right way? Um, yes, I believe so. Oops, oops. How did you beat me? Yeah, so we need to get up there. I don't remember how to get there though. Through here. We'll probably stumble across some secrets going back to old places. We definitely want to make the most of soils. We've got so many, uh, so many things. Was there a secret entrance to this? I can't remember. Hmm. Strange that we can't teleport there. I wonder if we can teleport there in the future. Uh, let's see. Restoration Hill. I can't believe it. I do like going back to old places that we visited so early in the game. Oh, this isn't... The hill. Can we fast travel? It's amazing what you forget. Can we fast travel in the past there? Yeah, I knew there was a tree there. There we go. Okay, we made it. We just need to go to the past to get to the hill. It's going to be a bit of an adventure just getting back there, to be honest. I wonder if he will fix it. If he does, I wonder if it's instant or if we have to go back. Right, we should be back. There we go. It's below us. We just need to get back there. Um, okay, we're taking a huge detour today. This is not what I thought we'd be doing. But I'm happy to do it if it fixes the hero's sword. Right, is there... A a quicker way. There's still a couple of acres here that we haven't faced yet. Right, let's put our Zora ring on. I thought we'd need it in the ocean, but there are even Zoras here. Aha! Doesn't affect us. Aha! <laughs> uh, right. We might just have to navigate through the entire thing again. But yeah, there's still a couple of uh, acres in this area that we haven't actually visited yet. Uh, oh, that's right. We need to teleport to the future from the bottom of the map. Or acre. So sneaky! So it should take us below the rocks. There we go. So there's this acre, but in the past that we haven't been to. And we don't know how to get up there yet either. A shortcut that I'm totally forgetting as well. Ooh. We 
This is not a very good acre to encounter the witch on. Oh, potion. Right near us as well. Oh no, I can't grab anything else. Yeah, that's not a very good acre. Haha, <laughs> now you're sorry I have more stuff than before. See, yeah, but we have a we have a potion. Right, I think this is probably still here from when we went last time. Uh, oh no, we need to get back to the past. It's so confusing. Trying to remember the way from something we did like a month ago. Maybe longer. But we can slowly get uh, get our way there. Hopefully this is the right way. It's going to be really awkward if this is not the right way. Oh, how do we get up? Um... Hmm. Is this the right way? I don't remember. <laughs> oh wait, from here we can teleport, can't we? I keep forgetting. Right, let's uh... Let's see where we're at. I think we need to be on those stairs there. How do we get up there? Hmm. I don't think that does anything to help us. I don't remember how we're actually supposed to get up to... Up to the hill. Let's just double check the map real quick. So we're in the past, aren't we? And we're only like two tiles there. How do we get down? I honestly don't remember. I think this is not the right way. We'll just have to keep exploring until we get there though. It's definitely somewhere around here because this is the way we had to go to get the nut fix for the Symmetry City. Um. Oh wait, what's down here? Be gone, creatures! Now we can go back to... back in time. And then, hopefully get closer. Just where we went. Okay, I think we're getting there. We made it! <laughs> oh my goodness. It's so funny. Okay, let's walk along the side here. Oops. I thought this would be the safest, but this better be the right place. 
Other than someone making us a raft, I can't think of... Oh, we can't get through. Um, I can't think of any other place that has made anything for us or fixed anything. Right, is there any... No, no acres around here that we need to go into. Please! I haven't seen you in a while. If you've come all the way up the wall, you must need something fixed. Uh, but my fa... Uh... Delicate ceremony is more di Oh no, I forgot! More mini games! Do you wish to try? Yes. I see, you want me to repair that broken sword. So it is you. So that is the trade sequence complete, I think. Uh, my restoration ceremony might fix it. Want to try? Yeah, we can try. I can't guarantee anything. Uh, you. Oh, how many rubies do we need for this? Follow me. We've got 175 rupees. Does it cost us every time, like the dancing game? Um, right. I can't remember what we have to do here. Uh, welcome to Patch's Crazy Cards. Will you partake in my ceremony? Yes, very well. Do you want to hear the rules? Yeah, I can't, I can't remember. Then let me explain. I'll place your broken sword on that green tile and recite the words of my restoration ceremony. You must knock all the beasts that appear into a hole. Any hole will do. Sounds easy, right? Oh. Restoration work is delicate. Your pre uh, precious broken sword sits on these tracks. The cart starts moving when the ceremony begins. As long as you stand on the switch, the cart won't hit your broken sword. Wait, can we just use the staff here? So we need to take part. Can we just put, the can we just put a block on the staff? <laughs> I mean, a block on the button. Uh, let the ceremony begin. Surely we can just do this, can't we? Oh no, they don't work! No! That's so much more tricky. Uh, we need to use the... Uh... No, we want to do it again. We need to use the... Um... The sword, uh, not the sword, the shield to get these things away from us. Oh no! This is impossible! Okay, we've got... How many rounds do we need to go? No! <laughs> okay, okay, we know what to do. It's just going to take a bit of a grind to get it done, but it's going to be worth it to get the next level sword. So we'll go through it again. I think the best way is to try and... Wait, actually, can we use... Why aren't I using these things? Oh, they don't work. That's why. Oh, more, more are approaching. No! Wow! This is going to be pure luck to whether we do it or not. It's a shame that this thing doesn't work. That would have been such a useful trick. Um, what is best against these things? Let's try this. Okay, it's def th th nothing seems to help. I think only being able to jump over them is the most helpful. Okay, that was we did it just in time. Yes, come over here. And then we just have to time our... I wonder how many jump down. Right, that's two lots. Oh, we only have to do it twice. Yes. That didn't take as long as I thought. I thought we'd be here all day. Um, my ceremony succeeded. You are talented. You got through this trap uh, ceremony. Here is your broken sword as good as new. As usual, I am perfect. Uh, here you go. You got the sacred noble sword. Yes. Bring me anything else that needs fixing and I'll prepare my uh, ceremony. 
is so cool. We've got the noble sword. There is a level three sword, like the master sword. And I think you can only get it by linking the games. And we have linked the games. But I don't know how to go about getting it. Um, right, is there anywhere else we need to visit up here? How do we get to these things? These random acres here. I wonder... Let's try and get to this one. If we go back on ourselves, we. Sh I wonder if we can... Ah, I'm falling. Right, there we go. Oh, can this break signs? It can break signs! <laughs> yeah, so we're quite close to an acre that we haven't visited yet. This is much more powerful sword, by the way. So that combined with the protection ring that we've got. Um... Oh, I destroyed the thing. Right, there we go. So we should be able to get up there, maybe. Yeah, but this sword uh, paired with the protection ring should give us a huge advantage with bigger bosses. Especially for a player like me who is so prone to taking um, hits <laughs> and uh, taking damage from enemies. Let's see if we can get to this acre here that we haven't been to yet. I don't know if this will lead the way or not. I don't know, because we need to get back to the past somehow, don't we? It's this acre, but in the past. Do we ever get a tune that allows us to go into the past? So it's not this acre, but it's this acre, but in the past. How do we do that? Oh, oh no, we missed the witch. I think at some point we must have to get back Get a tune that takes us back to the past. Like at any point. Because how else would we get to those acres? There's probably nothing important there for the game. But. Yeah. There must be a way up there. Okay, so I guess we need to head to the palace now. So it doesn't look like we're going to be able to get to that acre. There's two acres to get to actually. This one. And this one. And it seems like we can only get there from traveling from the past, uh, future to the past. But there doesn't seem to be any way to actually get there. But maybe I'm missing something. Oops. Right, so we should be able to head up to the gardens now. I don't think there's anything else we need to do now that we have the level 2 sword. For the trade sequence, that's pretty much... Um, yeah, that's the trade sequence completed. We have nothing left to trade. So... We've got two more instruments to get. Right, so there we go. I think that's a good place to wrap it up. A bit of a shorter episode today for Zelda, but it's pretty cool. I'm really excited uh, to move forward with this game. I wasn't expecting to do the trade sequence today, so that's a huge bonus before going into the palace. Assuming we're actually going to find our way in. We have to look for a secret passage, according to that person. <laughs> I can't remember his name now. But, yeah, so we'll do that in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're still enjoying the Zelda Oracle of Ages playthrough. It's a really fun puzzle. We do get lost sometimes, but we always kind of end up figuring it out. But let me know what you think. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And of course, a huge shout out to the channel members that make all this possible. If you'd like a Zelda emoji 
to use as a member please let me know because i'm in the process of redoing all the emojis for the channel so let me know your thoughts on having a link or a zelda emoji but thanks so much for watching have a great day and i'll see you in the next one bye